Okay, g'day, it's Matt here from Auto One Browns Plains. Today uh, I'm coming to you uh, from a selfie stick, but more importantly, I've got Chrissy here. Um, the girl in the van, or what's the name of your blog? Brisbane Girl in the Van. Brisbane Girl in the Van, okay, so um, Chrissy's here and uh, we're going to do a bit of a walkthrough, uh, have a quick look at her, uh, at her van slash home. So I'm just going to flip the camera around and we'll have a closer look. Okay, g'day Chrissy. So, um, how long have you been uh, in this van for? This van I've been in for a year. I had another one for a year before this one too. Yep, cool, cool. Loving the van life. Really loving the van life, more that's, and more. That's cool. All right, well, um, we'll probably just have a, a bit of a look around and uh, yeah. just see what you've done, what what sort of changes you've done to the van. I see you've got a, a blue board or a white board there with some... Uh, yes. Chalkboard. Yep. So um, I've got to write a new message. The rain keeps taking it off when I have the door ah, open. <laughs> yep, yep. So step one, buy a truck. Step two, build a home. Quit the job, live the dream. Quit. Ah, <laughs> okay, cool, cool. Oh, that's good. And um, inside, is there uh, anything that um, you've done that's a bit different in there? Um, if you have a look inside, one of the first things I did was I put in my windows, their caravan windows. Okay, yep, So yep. they sort of roll outwards and they all have fly screens. And then I put in my roof, which are actually meant to be a floor. Okay, I'm just gonna zoom in and yeah, look at that. I think that's one of my favourite pieces so far. That's very cool, um, very cool. And I've got a big water tank under the bed that's 300 litres. That actually came with my truck. It used to be a um, concrete business truck. Yep, yep. And I built a bed over the top of the water tank. Um, after that, I put in some batteries, um, a fridge. I've got the porta potty. And a back wall, I've got a few more walls to do, which is why I've got all this wood down here that's getting done this Friday. Cool. And um, my big cupboard, which is my kitchen and storage for all my clothing as well. Fantastic. Oh, that's cool. And um, so you've got solar on there now? I do. Um, yep. My batteries for a long time were charging just off my alternator while I was driving. Yep. So recently I've learned to do a lot of wiring things with the solar. I've got a 250 watt house panel right on the back on the top of the truck yep. and um, that charges everything. So I've got um, not a lot at the moment, the fridge, the lights and my phone, but um, over time I can put more on and it's going to keep everything charged up. Yeah, nice. Okay. Do you mind if I do a quick round? Absolutely. I'm thinking of eventually getting some way to fly screen the back door. Yep. Like maybe a big double sort of zip up or magnetic one. Yeah, you can cool. Have cool. it open during the summer because a lot of the time the bugs get in, especially if it's you know coming on night time and I've got all the lights on, they just fly on. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Cool. Okay. Very good. And um, so you you choose different spots to sort of camp out and sort of have your set up? Usually I stay somewhere different every night. Ah, um, yep, yep. I pick a lot of spots looking on Google Maps, you know, yep. where it's green or where it's blue. Um, I stay at a lot of places where, you know, people that I know will say, hey, I saw this great spot, you yep. should stay yep. there. Um, cool. Like lots of boat ramps and yeah. forests and, you know, car parks for hikes and things like that. Cool. Oh, very good. And I like this uh, texture that you've got going on here. It took me a long time to pick the bricks. I almost went with the red bricks. I wanted it to look a little bit industrial. Yep. But um, I bought those online. I put it on my back wall and inside of the truck as well. And um, I love it. Very good. All right. Well, thank you for showing us around. My pleasure. And uh, we'll talk to you next time.